bit of a pothole, but then again, maybe it's explained in the side material. The um, apparently, like there is a Warcraft World of Warcraft Chronicle book or something, uh, Chronicles or something, and it's it, I think it might be explained there. I remember uh, Jesse Cox was saying that it's explained there. It, well, a lot of the stuff in the pre-patch was actually referenced in outside mater game materials. And he was saying that if you hadn't read them, you know, you wouldn't be able to follow along. Though that's... I found it actually easy enough to follow along. But it's just, I'm thinking, maybe there's outside materials that maybe explain some plot holes that, that, that I'm running into now because I didn't read the books. Well, once we get up here, if the end, these demons are still falling, I'll help them kill them off. Or, yeah, they're a warrior. For a moment, I was thinking, what, are they a rogue or something? Or did they just cloak? But no. Did I accidentally reject that? Because I meant to hit accept. Pack mentality. Oh. Nasty. That was a misclick. Oh, he also smacks people around a bit for before pissing off. Cool. Invite. Oh, holy. Stay out here uh, during the landing. During the landing. To be honest, we're just by the Griffin, so. Oh, okay. Just need someone to come out and help me. And the warrior's coming on out. Uh. Eh, we can leave that there. And the druid's on their way over. Could... Could summon them, but... Could just wait a second. Eh. Actually, no. We can wait a second. That is a very cool door. That the buff. Oh, they have a legendary. I still haven't got one yet. Doesn't help that mo I mostly do mythics now. Um, if I was actually doing, you know, content that can give drops, you know, I'll be, you know, actually able to get. Uh, I would actually have a chance of getting a legendary. Ooh, dungeon quest. The ward breaker. Oh, okay. So... Yeah, everyone else is in. I didn't notice the other person run back on in. Just double check everyone's in before I start on... The vault is Reset it. With magical one such system may be found within the prison built to defeat uh, the demon. Then complete the startup sequence to restore power to the world. Proven healer for wins. Yep, oh, everyone's here. Apologies for the sequence. Warden Malice is very fond of puzzles. Well, when they die, they buff their allies and whatnot. Oh, Christ. 
So everyone's in. Yep. I swear I've seen that surname before. Maybe, I think there's a guy in uh, Elwyn, uh, no, uh, whatever the name of the uh, Blood Elf place is, is. Uh, I believe there's a guy there who, uh, he, he, you know, he's always, he's having the party. Uh, you saw him on my uh, last playthrough, I can't remember his name. He's only relevant to two quests, and one quest is just go talk to the guy. And the other is grab the stuff for his party, and that's it. He's no more relevant. Um, so, I've no idea, uh, I, you know, doesn't exactly take up much brain space due to his lack of relevancy. Really need to get back to running the Alps and whatnot. Um, haven't done them in a while. Um, uh, whenever I'm f f logging in, you may have noticed a level ten, ro uh, level eight rogue. That is a uh, my human character. I'm going to be leveling up him up into either Westfall or uh, Red Ridge Mountains. Then I will bring over my higher level rogue to. Uh, Duskwood or Red Ridge Mountains, depending on where I leave off. And then I'll be leveling in. Uh, Christ. Christ, Christ. I'll be bolstered. Shield. I think I should have told him it was bolstering. How much of my gear is now busted? Didn't realize it was as bad as it was. And there's no way to repair in instance. Unless you got a... Uh, Jeeves. Um, out of curiosity, I wonder, do I have anything lingering around that could s take the slot of my Tang? Like, uh, equal tier stuff. No. Just gonna have to go being slightly gimped. I couldn't leave, I doubt I could leave even to just pop down to the other place. We protect life, often at great risk. Too often. Uh, yeah, I'll just have to continue going with what I have. Eh. I think I was making a, a point talking about some there, making a point, but honestly, I don't remember. I also saw a ghost elf there for a moment. Not sure who or what that was. Uh, it might have been a person's trinket or, or, or something. But I'm not entirely sure. I'm using a lot of divine storms now. Interrupt. Need to get the buff that makes it heal people for a bit as well. Because that's useful. Should still be able to get all three chests, which will be very nice. Then, of course, we've grown a little bit into this. Maybe we, you know, will do really poorly on the rest of them. Gear's already mostly yellow. If I really need to, I will pop out and um, get it repaired. Unless someone here has a Jeeves. I really wish there was a way to repair my own gear in the field. That's one advantage Final Fantasy um, 14 has. 
uh, Final Fantasy XIV has over WoW. You can just repair your stuff uh, in defeat. Uh, well, actually, you can repair your gear, gear full stop. Um, like, you don't need an NPC or whatnot. As long as you have the skill to repair it, you can repair it. And the, the repair skills di differ depending on the gear. Um, as, you know, different things go into making the... Ma as the different gear goes into making it. Uh, like, you know, a golden necklace needs different... Um, it needs different... Um, you know, repair methods than, say, a... Um, you know, pit, bit of court armor. So, you know, accordingly, it, you know, you need different skills. But, as, like I said, as long as you have the skills, you can repair your gear just fine. Okay. No, it still counts as uh, humanoid. Which, it's kind of irrelevant in all honesty. The only uh, advantage of someone that has of being a de cast as a demon is that they, um... A, and is it, when they're a non-boss. Divine ship. Do that. Move. Is when they're non-bosses, then they'll get stunned and, uh, stunned by, uh, ashes to ashes. wasn't enough. Thank you for your help. Your intervention saved my life. I swear that guy is voiced by the same person who does voices the um, uh, Templar from Diablo 3. I really hope we get uh, another Diablo 3 expansion. Um, we got one Reaper Souls, but we got one. I hope we get another one. Oh Christ, this is going to go poorly. Wait. They don't buff. They don't buff. Oh, hallelujah. Oh, glorious day. But yeah. The, um... Don't know what I'm saying. Yeah, I, I'm sorry. I got ahead like a sieve. You could seriously, you could drain pasta with me. You could drain pasta with it. I'm just like really sieve like memory. It's actually quite annoying, quite irritating. It's uncomfortable in all honesty. Okay. They just kept resetting there. I'm not looking forward to this fight. He's burlier than the last time I saw him. Though so am I. When they say stop casting, I'm not really sure do they mean, like, am I included in that? Because most of my things are abilities. on this thing, enormous stone quillin, alright. Is that how you even say it? Move. Damn it, I should have waited. And yeah, it's when they say cast, they mean use abilities full stop. Oh, Fuck! Um... Asking protection. Four. Fuck. Two. 
That was strange. I don't even know why, why that happened. But I had no control over that. Boy Touch Juggernaut. That, I remember the Quillen was a Miss Pandaria thing, and while the Void Touch Juggernaut is a um, face uh, thing of the. Um, I think you actually have to do that. Um, hmm. You just have to choose what you don't get to use for a while. But anyway, um, Void Touch uh, Juggernauts are uh, oh god thing, so are those guys. Whatever that was. Wait, did I lose my buff? Yeah, it seems you can't have three of the things up anymore. You're de you're restricted to maybe two, which is irritating. Hmm. Yeah, you're restricted to two now. That's fantastic. I kind of hope I could buff myself with um, the Blessing of Kings. Just uh, make up for the fact my bracers were botched. Just the extra little bit of uh, pelt, basically. Uh, but no. Just curious if my item level is affected by my broken gear, but no. I think we're going quickly enough with this. But anyway. Just noticing the ravens just dive bombing the uh, beholder here. It's a funny image. Oh yeah, I remember what I was saying earlier. That's the first boss. I swear he's voiced with a Templar from Diablo Tree. And I hope that we get another Diablo 3 expansion. Someone was claiming online, uh, there's some journal uh, games journalist, was claiming that, um, uh, the, oh, Christ, shield. Any mirror that has to be destroyed? No. Uh, they were claiming that, um, uh, there was going to be an expansion for Diablo 3, but it got cancelled because Diablo 3 wasn't as profitable as um, other Blizzard games. So they just weren't going to come out with uh, the expansion they planned for it. But. Um, but, you know, it's plenty possible that, you know, these um, journals were wrong, basically. The, their source, like they claimed they had some inside source saying that's the reason why that you know Diablo was profitable enough, so they weren't going to do an expansion for uh, expansion for it. Um, well, a second expansion for it, but I don't know if that's true. So here's hoping that we get the expansion because I would love that. I had a lot of fun playing it. It's not my kind of game, but I'll be willing to play it just for the um, you know. Car you know, the story and all that. No, like, I found it fun enough, despite, you know, like I said, mechanics not really being my kind of thing. Hmm. Okay, it seems someone is on the, uh, on the defenses. Because uh, we didn't talk it over, so I just realized, you know, what's exactly going to happen. My